here we are at another beautiful Pacific Northwest day in Pacific Raceways. Um, as you can see, we're getting light rain, you know, not too bad. Um, things stayed mostly dry, but the lens of the camera is not, not too dry. Um, so I've started us with, uh, with one lap to go. We just crossed the start-finish a little bit ago, and now we're just about to go down to the valley of the escape route. Um, I'm liking my position right now. Uh, you can see Sam Frigo, a good sprinter, ahead of me. Also big guy, good draft. In front of him is the uh, race leader, Johan Brusa. Very, very strong sprinter. We've been doing points per lap this whole race, and so I've gotten, I got a preem and I got a few lap points. Um, in the process, everybody's legs are super tired <laughs> from from points per lap, but uh, we're gonna we're just about now to uh, go do an actual field sprint. Um, that rider up the road must be lap traffic or from another field or something like that. So we're going a little bit slow here. You can see uh, people are starting to move up. This uh, this lead out isn't doing very much leading out right now. Um, Yuhan's got a couple of his teammates up in front of him, and I'm sort of betting on them doing some good work to uh, prevent an attack. Um, oh, you can see, see Kiel Reinen uh, coming up on the left there. Uh, pro? Former pro? Uh, not 100% clear. Local celebrity. Um, in the uh, brilliant orange uh, vest came out and uh, did some interviews on a mic. Got a little bit of a mix up here, but as you can see, nobody's going to let Keel get away, so everything's still likely to stay together. And with this little mix-up, I've uh, put myself on Yuhan's wheel, which is perfect for me. I imagine Sam is right behind me. Rather, rather look at the two of us than uh, have me on his wheel. Um, I'm quite happy to be on Yuhan's wheel right here. I know he's going to get a good lead out from his teammates. Oh uh, yeah, bike racing. This is my favorite point in the race. Just messing around up until this point. Here we go, we start to wind it up. And so this is a little bit of a lead out fail. Um, but it's working okay. You can see Will Cucko here takes uh, the wheel of Yuhan's lead out. Uh, now it's just Yuhan into the wind, and we're pretty far from the finish line. I'm super happy to have this draft. But I see Sam coming up on the left, so I think it's time to come around. 1100 watts. The throw for the wind. But I hear the bell. So they, they gave us two laps to go. Two laps ago. Um, but apparently on the last lap, we came through uh, with the mas Masters Field. Um, and so they didn't want to ring the bell at us because the Masters Field was finishing at the, the time. We just There's were, you know, go. passing some of the people at the back of the Masters There's Field. No and so they decided to give us one more lap. Well, everybody just sprinted for the finish. And so you can see we're all confused. Everybody's looking back. We're all ready to, uh, to be done with this race. <laughs> But they're yelling at us. The officials are saying one more lap, and I'm uh, I'm reasonably upset. I uh, just won the race, and now I'm told that no, actually, you're gonna have to sprint again. Just uh, burned a pretty hard match there. <laughs> Sorry for the cursing, folks. You might appreciate my frustration. Um, so here we go. I better. <laughs> Better get in position. Luckily, everybody uh, everybody was tired from this and didn't want to go again, so I didn't have to go too deep into the red to uh, get back up to the front of the group. 
you can see this uh, one guy sent a flyer as soon as he saw that it was uh, one more lap uh, went off the front and we're all looking at each other nobody wants to chase that guy we're all pretty gassed so fucking bullshit. <laughs> it is bullshit um, Oh, yeah, bike racing. You know, I, I don't fault the officials for... you gotta, You got to make a call somewhere. I think that they they maybe made the wrong call, but they had to make a call with the information that they had, and, is, is, you know, whatever call they make is the right one. I can be grumpy about it, but I can't fault them for it. So I want Yuhan's wheel, but uh, Will here is... Uh, pretty interested in that wheel too and just so long as he holds it to the finish line I don't I don't mind holding Will's wheel. Regretfully he's on junior gearing so it's uh pretty hard to keep things together on this uh this downhill when you have to spin at 140 RPM to uh to match speed. I should have got a lens wipe in here, sorry folks. I was too focused on racing. To remember you. Hopefully that'll clear up before we uh, get too close to the finish line and get a good view of it. My legs are just feeling toast right now. I am not looking forward to sprinting. I am fully expecting to uh, not be able to sprint at all and have somebody who didn't sprint for one reason or another with fresher legs come around right at the end. But I'm not in bad position. We've got a uh, Yuhan again in the leader's jersey, he's got at least one teammate ahead of him that's uh, going to do a lead out here. And I'm hoping that he'll close down the gap to this guy who just attacked. You know, if anything, I'm a little bit too close to the front, but given where we are, <laughs> the fact that we just, uh, just all sprinted our, our eyeballs out of our head. Uh, this isn't the worst place to be. You know, by this point I've gotten a pretty good rest, so I'm starting to feel like maybe I can jump again. But speeds are way down. Normally at this point we'd be going 35 miles an hour. Again, Yuhan is forced to jump early, way, way earlier this time. And I'm looking up at that rider up the road thinking like, gosh, if I if I jump, maybe I can maybe I can chase him down. And so I try to go a little bit earlier. Gosh, can't even get above <laughs> nine hundred watts. This is all I have. And can't quite get him at the line. Oh well, it was fun. I still got the USAC points for first for some reason.